chapter 8 it is uh, classes and objects in java let's start a quick chapter summary so first i select a file tip okay pen and then the what is class so uh, object and class these are the fundamental part of the object oriented programming right and uh, class it is the template for multiple objects with the similar features then in the java programming the class it is defined by using this word that word is a class keyword right and class contains both data and its uh, data or its attribute or and the program code right so class components the class components it is uh, uh, generally made up of the two components that are the attributes and its behavior so attributes it is defined by using the variables right and your behavior it is uh, you can define it by using the different methods in the in your program or the class right and methods are used to access or modify attributes right and creating objects if you want to create objects then you can to create objects from a class requires the following first one it is declaration instantiations initialization so what is it the declaration part variable name of type class it is declared with the class name and its variable name after that instantiations you have to use the new keyword right it is used to create the objects right by allocating memory and initialization so this constructor it is called the initialize a newly created object after that in the object topic using the new keyword we can create an object after that operator new allocates the memory for an object and returns the address of the object for later use after that reference it is the address of the memory location where the object it is stored right in fact there is a special portion of memory it is called the heap where the objects are stored okay then in the instance in the java when the objects are no more needed the memory is reclaimed back to reuse right this is a good option available in the java programming okay java has the garbage collector right and that looks for the unused objects and reclaim the memory to those objects are using after that we summarize this object it is uh, objects are created with a new keyword right the new keyword returns the reference to an object that uh, represents an instance of the class right and all instance of the class are allocate allocated memory in data structures structure it is called heap if you are accessing instance variables then instance variable and the instance methods are accessed by using objects and they can be refer by using dot operator right object reference dot instance variable or you add method and the dot it is an operator and dot operators associative gravity uh, is from the left to right side after that classification of variables there are local variables and instance variables in that local variables it defines inside the method or the blocks and creates the method or the blocks restarted and destroyed when the method or the block is completed not initialized by the default values what is in that instance variable the it is defined within a class but outside any method allocating memory from the heap area and initialize by using the default values what is in that class variable it defines with a class outside any method with the static keyword and allocating memory only once per class it is shared by all its object and initialize by using the default values next one topic it is the polymorphism polymorphism means many forms right different uh, forms of the methods with the same name in the java we can have the different methods that have the same name 
but the different signature it is called the method overloading after that visibility uh, modifier for access control access control it is about the controlling visibility right access modifiers are known as visibility modifiers also right and there are four levels of visibility provide necessary protections the first level protections you define by using the plus sign public second level package right till the symbol is used after that uh, protected has symbol is used and the hyphen symbol it is used for the private so public it is the first uh, level of access and this is the widest possible access right and it is provide the class defined to the other package also next one it is the package right and the second level of access and then this is uh, the default level of the protection right and uh, it has no precise name third number it is uh, the protected visibility is narrower than the public and the package but wider than the full private privacy provided by the fourth level private In the fourth level of access it is private it is highest level protection possible and it provides the narrowest visibility the last one next topic it is uh, accessor and uh, mediator method allow such data to be used by others then write accessor method an accessor method it is capitalize the first letter of variable name and use prefix get which known as getter allow such data to be modified by others then write mutator method right and mutator method it is uh, to capitalize the first letter of variable name and use prefix set which is known as setter and this is the end of chapter number 8 summary